नदियन पिए कभी अपना ज वृक्ष न खाए कभी अपने फल अपने तन का मन का धन का दूजो को दे दो ध्यान है वो सच्चा इंसान रे इस धरती का भगवान है ओह नाइस भजन एंड सेंग ओ be like the trees that they bear their fruits and they no partake of it so that we can take it the birds and all of nature and also the river is flowing and giving all the nourishment coming from the pure waters from the mountains and the forests and they go and fertilize the land we drink it and all the necessities for water but um let us be like that and a person who can be like that to serve the world they are verily gods on earth nadiyan piya kabhi apna jal vriksh na khai kabhi apne phal apne tan ka man ka dhan ka dujo ko de do dhyan hai wo sacha insaan re इस धरती का भगवान है अगर सज से का अंग जले और दुनिया समेत सवास दे दीपक से उसका जीवन है जो दूजो को अपना प्रकाश दे दूजो को अपना प्रकाश दे धर्म ही जस का भगवत गीता धर्म ही जिस का भगवत गीता सेवा ही वेद पुराण है वो सच्चा इंसान रे इस धरती का भगवान है नदियन पिए कभी अपना जल वृक्ष न खाए कभी अपने फल अपने तन का मन का धन का दूजो को दे दो ध्यान है वो सचा इंसान रे इस धरती का भगवान है चाहे कोई गुणगान करे चाहे को रे निंदा कोई फूलों से कोई सत्कार करे कांते च भो जाए कोई कांते च भो जाए कोई मान और अपमान ही दोनों मान और अपमान ही दोनों जिसके लिए समान है वो सच्चा इंसान रे इस धरती का भगवान है let us be that light that divine light that radiates to all and as we go through our journey in this earthly sojourn let us be uh, serve the gita let us be guided by the gitas and the puranas or scriptures the authorances of our incarnations and spiritual masters and then but remember when you try to do this you'll be going against the masses so be prepared to bear the criticisms sometimes you be welcome with flowers and sometimes you be welcome with insulting words and disrespect but that shouldn't be your trouble because you know you know what your goal is and this morning i just want to welcome you to this monday and what a beautiful morning the birds are coming in look at them flying in and they're landing in the water what a beautiful scenery nature it's its best well the sun is out and let's pay our devotions to surya narayan chant with me the gayatri mantra the mantra that is so powerful when you chant it you get in the benefits of all the cha- billions of time that has been chanted om bhur bhavasva tat savitur varenyam भार्गो देवस्यधीम धियो यो न प्रचोदया ओ भुर्भुवस्व तत्सुर्वरेण्यम 
भार्गो देवस्य धीमहि धीयो यो न प्रचोदयत ओम भूर्भव स्वाहात्सुर्वरेण्यम भार्गो देवस्य धीमहि धीयो यो न प्रचोदयत Adorations to Surya Narayan, adorations to Mother Earth, adorations to water, air, and of course sun, it's fire, and space. So these are the murtis that is in us, and we always have to keep reminding ourselves that, that we are the, uh, our body is the lower manifestation, the lower nature of God, and inside of us the higher nature is there. That is consciousness. We are complete. Om Purnamada Purnamidam Purnat Purnamudachate Purnasya Purnamadhaya Purnameva Vashishyate Om oh. Well, it's a beautiful morning here. The sun is coming out. And today it's, you know, that America is changing, the world is changing. And sad to say that we're coming back to the second phase of this coronavirus. The first phase has taken so many lives here in America and India and in Nepal and all parts of the world. We might say, well, we do the precautions, many lives will be saved. Well, that is true because uh, the science will tell us this is how it is. But when people die, we cannot say, well, it's the... Um, it's, it's a mistake because this virus is so powerful that it, um, it has, we don't even understand it, how it travels, is, is it in the air, is it if we stay six feet away that we are free from it. Well, we do, we follow the, the, the science as much as they tell us to do. But if people die, don't blame it on anyone else. In America, you know, this is... Is that we're going through a very difficult time. Well, not difficult, but transformation. That um, we're shifting, we're looking to shift more towards socialism. Uh, America in the past has been a country primarily on capitalism, where everyone is encouraged to use their skills and entrepreneurship to create businesses for themselves. This is the motivating force that drives human being to be the best capitalism. But in socialism, that the wealth is looked to be distributed evenly, and it takes away that driving force. So it is not so great as I would think. And this is where we are, we are thinking that um, it's not good. But whatever is happening, it has to be what it is. It has to be what it is. So this morning, um, today is going to be the debate between Kamala Harris and our Vice President Pence. And uh, you know, everybody's looking to forward and see because it is said that these two people are in, in line to become the President of the country. So because of President Trump, you know, he's got Corona and Joe Biden is getting old. So it's very important that America is going through a change. And with, with President Trump saying that there will be no negotiations for this stimulus package because it's not going anywhere because of the two parties, the Democrats and the Republicans. Now, by shutting that down and after the election, America has come to the level of the rest of the world where everyone has the, um, the challenge of uh, surviving. At the same time, there have to be a balance between the um, oh, going to work and taking the risk, because life is a risk, and taking the risk of um, uh, catching the virus. But that balance has been there because we cannot be locked up all the time. And, um, you know, we, we have to uh, make that effort to go out there. We have to, there's a challenge for us. These are all changing times. 
And this is the nature of this manifested universe. It's constantly changing because it's created and it's constantly deteriorating. Know that for sure. But we have an alternative and the alternative is to see it for what it is. And to go and to gradually answer the question, what is the alternative? And that is to find out, to go to that place of being where we are not affected by what's created. Because there is a place like that state of being and it is Satchidana, truth, consciousness and bliss. It is omnipotent, all-powerful, divine power, 100%, 100% of the time and it's all-pervading. It's here, there and everywhere and it's omniscient. It knows the past, it's all-knowing. So this is the description of perfection. This is the description of moksha. This is the description of Krishna Bhagwan and Swami Pranavanandaji and all the great realized souls, spiritual masters. So we have the potential of being like that. So let us all keep that in mind. It is easier for, t for me to tell you that we are all gods, gods and goddesses. It's so easy to tell you that rather than tell you otherwise. Because if I encourage you to be have the luxury of this life then you wouldn't be thinking of God it's only when we are in distress that we think about God so this morning let us all join in prayers and um, pray that um, everything will be good not for America but all of the world and let us bring the Guru because the Guru is the one that's going to help us Om. Jnana Mulam Guru Murti Puja Mulam Guru Param Mantra Mulam Guru Vakyam Moksha Mulam Guru Kripa Moksha Mulam Guru Kripa The Guru is the one that's going to do everything because we need him to take us to that place where our sorrows will end. We pay adorations to the Buddha, the Christ, and all these great gurus. Well, this morning is a simple message that um, let us be prepared for everything that is happening. We shouldn't be disturbed by anything. And um, let us do some chanting of mantra Om Sri Guru Shivaye Nama. Om Sri Guru Shivaye Nama. Om Sri Guru Shivaye Nama 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 Om Sri Guru Shivaye Namaha Well, I hope you're invigorated. I hope that you're in spirit. Meaning that your thoughts break their bonds. Your mind transcends limitation. Your consciousness expands in every direction. You find yourself to be in a great new wonderful world. Dormant forces, faculties, and talents come alive and you find out that you are a far better person than you ever dreamed to be. This is what it feels to be a spiritual person because there is no limitations. And have a mind that's open to everything. I'm asking you to transcend the mundane and go into the spiritual. Blessings are flowing your way. Look at this, the sun is shining. The water is flowing refreshingly. The birds are enjoying themselves. And so we too, let us live in that place of, of bliss. Hari Om Shanti Shanti Hari Om. Blessings, blessings, blessings on a beautiful day. Hari Om Shanti Shanti Hari Om.